People pleasing isn't at all fun. It is very exhausting, draining, and so unfulfilling. It is when your life revolves around the need to make other people happy, even at the expense of your own happiness. It is when the opinion of other people basically rules your life. So, how exactly do you stop people pleasing and ultimately become happier? Now, I use the word ultimately because when you start to stop people pleasing, it becomes uncomfortable and if, especially if you're so used to it, it's uncomfortable and sometimes you feel like you're doing something wrong. But once you keep practicing the steps I'm going to be discussing in this video, you will realize that ultimately you are a happier person because now you are free of the judgment and thus the burden of the need to please other people. So let's dive in on how to stop people pleasing. Welcome back to Yasin's Inspiration. If you're new to this channel, Yasin's Inspiration is all about um, personal growth, changing mindsets, and developing great lifestyles to be able to live a fulfilling and a meaningful life. And the first thing I want to talk to you guys about is to love yourself. I spoke about self-love in my, in my um, second to last video and it is basically the foundation of everything I'm going to be talking about in this video because the main reason why people indulge in people pleasing is the need for other people to like them you want other people to like you so you basically do whatever they want or you want to make them happy even at the expense of your own happiness now self-love on the other hand will allow you to to um, go for experiences that will make you happy and bring you joy and not just because your boss or your friends or your colleagues want, wants you to do it. Jim Quick in his book Limitless says that it is not your job to like, love or respect me. It is mine. So when you love yourself, you don't, you don't, you don't have the need to, for other people to love you. you, don't, you, you the need to be, um, to be loved and liked by other people diminishes yeah, like instantly. So self-love, self-love, self-love. Once you love yourself so much, you start to set boundaries. Boundaries are the limits that we set for other people in our life. It is the things that you will do or allow and the things that you will never tolerate. It is the places that you will go to and the ones that you will not. It is the people that you want to hang around with and the ones that you basically don't want to be around. Okay. So once you set boundaries, it is clear to you the kind of things that you want to welcome into your life and the things that you just don't want to tolerate at all. And once you set boundaries and you know the things that you, you, you will allow and the things that you will never tolerate, then it is clear to you the things that you want to say yes to. If you do not set boundaries, you will become a people pleaser. You will see yourself being everywhere, trying to do everything for other people to make them happy and not to make yourself happy. So set boundaries right now like take an pen and paper and write down the things that you want to allow in your life and the things that you will never allow in your life and once you set those boundaries then you learn to say no you can say no to things that don't serve you and the things that you do not want to be involved in at all like i have a video on how to um, how to say no to other people and, and, and learning to say no but basically it's just the the idea of of putting your needs and your priorities first and saying no to things that don't serve you and things that actually don't add value to your life, right? The need to put people please will, will make you say yes to almost everything. And like I said, this is exhausting. Like, it is draining to be a people pleaser. So set boundaries, love yourself, set boundaries and learn to say no. The last and the final thing I want to discuss with you guys is that once you figured all of these things out, once you've set boundaries, you've developed that self-love and you learn to say no to other people and you've realized that it is not worth, worth it, then communicate, speak up, communicate how you feel about some things. Like don't just say, don't be a yes man, like don't just be saying yes to other people and just don't just be saying I'm not a people pleaser, that's it, no. You have to communicate. You have to, if someone tells you, asks for a request or asks you for something that they want you to do, politely and with grace say no. Speak about your boundaries. I don't tolerate this. I do not like this. Like if you don't speak up, people will take you for granted. Oh, they'll be like, Yasin? Oh, no way. She will say yes. Because they know Yasin, Yasin always says yes to everything. So whatever, they will take advantage of you. So if you don't want that to happen to you, speak up. And you can speak up in a very polite 
and in a very respectful manner that you wouldn't be rude and if other people don't take it well oh that is that is that is not in your hands like it, it, I, I said it before you're not responsible for how the other people or how the other person is going to react to what you're gonna say just make sure you are respectful and you are polite and you do it with grace and with honor and that is it the rest is like up for them like any other process of breaking a bad habit stopping people pleasing might take a time give yourself the time that you need but make sure you start working on these steps now because you deserve to be happy you deserve other people also to like respect your views and the things that you want and your boundaries so once you realize that you have the right to say no because you do like you don't always have to say yes to everything you have the ultimate and the full power to say no to the things that don't serve you and the things that don't bring you joy so once you realize this start working on these steps now and it might take time just give yourself time all, all the time that you will need but make sure you start working on this like i said and you will be happy ultimately for sure you will be happier and that is all i have for you in this video this is yasin once again see you see you guys next week and yeah be happy be safe and take care and i will see you again i'm signing off for today don't forget to subscribe below and like the video